following program is from NET, the Public Television Network. Metropolitan Entertainment presents Quintet's Animation Extravaganza, episode 67, Usaki, Sailor Moon. Land. As you can see, I've just finished my script for Chapter 14 of Humans of Sentai Go Ranger. Skullmask has sure gotten what he deserved. Anyway, I was just about to stop by a popular arcade called Game Crown. You're just in time to come with me. Come on! So, Game Crown has lots of classic arcade games. Donkey Kong, Pac-Man, Space Invaders, you name it. One of my favorite arcade games to play here is none other than Mortal Kombat. That's right, where seven mortals face off against each other in order to become the champion. Hey, Quentin's Rock! Oh, hi, Miyako. Didn't expect to find you here. Well, we're happy to be good at video games, so... Mortal Kombat! Quentin's on by! Wait, is that Mortal Kombat? Sure is, Usagi. Get over here! <laughs> it's time for a fiery inferno! Oh, no! Scorpion wins fatality. Hey, good game! Sure wish I was good at finding names. Hey, it's that cat from yesterday. You mean that kitty with the bald spot? Um, I think you've offended her. Anyway, I gotta go. Nice seeing you, girls. Quentin Cole, nice to meet you. Did that cat just talk to me? Wait, what? Pardon me. My name is Luna. I've been sent from the moon to seek help from you two, as well as help from the other Kotokojis in the main six. You know what the weird crime's happening here in Animation Land? Now listen! Oh my god! Could Usagi really be the Moon Princess? We met around our princesses in the main six! So what's the mission? Wait a minute. I can sense trouble right now. Naruto Osaka is being strangled by her own mother! She would never do that! This mother is an imposter! And this is no masked monster! This is a different kind of monster altogether! Come on! To Osapi! Transformation! Put that girl down! Huh? I said PUT THAT GIRL DOWN! Are you the power folks? And the main six? I'm delighted to meet such celebrities. Well, my introduction shall be cut short. Wake up, my slaves! Destroy the power puffs and the main six! Aren't those Usagi's fans among them? Oh my god, they are! Those jewels they're wearing, they're controlling them. Well, at least Naru isn't wearing one. Bowser, you take on Morga! We'll handle the slaves! You monster sword hag! Her outfit's even prettier than before. And you are? The brave soldier that fights from love and justice! I am... Sailor Moon! Sailor Moon? Never heard of that name before. Slaves, destroy her! Ow! That hurts! Why, please! Why do I have to suffer like this? I can't take it anymore! I want to go home! Oh god! What's with these high frequency waves? Soggy, grab your tiara and shout, Moon Tiara action! Moon Tiara action! Well, I'll be darned, she actually killed Morga! Wow, she definitely wasn't a masked monster. While the Black Cross Army's masked monsters explode when they die, Morga disintegrated into sand and disappeared. Well done, Sailor Moon. My name is Tuxedo Mask. I'm pleased to meet you. I will never forget this night. Farewell. Wow, Sailor Moon's really got the hots for that guy. Wow, Usagi has become an ally. 
I bet she'll become useful against this new enemy I feel we'll have to face. Anyway, thanks for all your help. Prepare yourself for the fight with Commander in Chief Golden Mask, okay? Alright, see you later. This episode was loosely based on a chapter of Pre Soldier Sailor Moon, written by Naoki Takeuchi, copyright 1992 to 1997. This program is a production of What's a Quattle Entertainment? This is NET, the public television network.